So we're leaving Toronto Pearson for JFK. And we've got Toronto approach departure online. Not sure which to contact actually. 132.8. 132.8. Let's just tune that in. 132. Just wait. I haven't done an American departure in a while. Clearance. Hopefully it's fairly quiet. Let me just have a look at the traffic. Oh, seriously? Oh, right. Okay, so not much traffic. That's good. If it's not too busy, I'll have time to ask questions. Okay, we're already boarding. That's good. Uh, we've got the weather already, and our altimeter is 29 or 9 or 8, according to Information Lima. Two nine or nine or eights. And on the standby instrument, it's gonna be what? One zero one five. Perfect. Okay, so let's go ahead and get our flight plan in. Our departure today is gonna be from two three the captain. Uh, two departure. Two three. Kept kept at two. Kept at two. There it is. Terminal good afternoon Air Canada one zero two one zero thousand for eight thousand. Terminal, good afternoon, Akina 102, uh, 90,000 for 8,000 in Bandad said. There's only myself and this guy in radar, in range, no one else. Okay, let's have a look at the charts for departure. Yeah, nothing happening there. Right, okay, fair enough. Control to Akina 102, ready to check. Stand by. Ah, oh, there he is, okay. Uh, let's see. Taxi charts. Air Canada 102, Rebels. Yeah, go Air Canada 102. Air Canada 102, Rebels, squad 2206. 2206 coming down, Air Canada 102. Let's keep that on. We're at uh, C29. Yeah, 102 Rebels identified runway 24 right, altimeter 299 or 8. Information Lima is not current. Descend 3000. Not very tough, okay, I can't want to. Well, it's risky. And we'll keep this one as well. We're going out of 2 3 from here, so that's handy. Uh, departure kept. Uh, to two was it? Yeah, kept to two. Well, so far he's. We have to be cleared for kept to two departure. Where is kept to two departure from? Oh, there it is from two three. Okay, let's just see what he has to say now. Uh, information latest is Lima. Yep, yeah, hasn't changed.
Corona departure. Good evening, American Airlines 13 Kilo is an Airbus A320. We're at gate Charlie 2 Niner. Uh, we're on Information Lima and we have altimeter 2 Niner Niner 8. We're looking for clearance for New York JFK. American 13 Kilo departure. Uh, thanks for Lima. You're clear to the John F. Kennedy Airport for the Kepler 2 departure. Bumper transition by plane group. Depart runway 23 squawk 2211. Clear to JFK via the uh, Kepta 2 departure, direct bumper, and squawk 2211. American 13 Kilo Reback is correct. Push and start is at your discretion coming for taxi. Push and start at our discretion and we'll call for taxi. American 13 Kilo, thank you. Awesome. Okay. Bumper transition, not direct bumper. So it actually wasn't correct, but anyway, okay. Bumper, there we are. Bumper transition. And our arrival for the moment, we're going to say 2 2 left. I know 2 2 left was the active on the 8 is for JFK. And we're coming in on ING, or sorry, IGN 1, India Gulf, November 1. And no vias yeah, or vias. We have uh, large turbulence uh, between 8,000 and 9,000, and that's severe icing as well. Severe icing. Thank you, that's limited. Another 102 turn right, heading 150. Right, 150. Let me get this chart for JFK just so I can have that in there. So I. Oh, I see. So that's not on an arrival. IGM 1. That's funny. So for runway two two left. Our initial approach will be Kimball. Yes. No star. Just in via IGN. Let's keep that and let's get our airport. And uh, let's see. International, nope. It's not going to be international. Let's keep that parking gates there. You're kind of 102 turn right heading. You're kind of 102 turn right heading 210 intercept localizer for the LSC for that approach. Okay. Heading again, I cannot watch the trip. Air Canada 102, turn right, heading 210 and intercept the localizer. Cleared ILS 24, right approach. Right 210, cleared ILS 24, right approach. I cannot um, 102. Okay. So here's our flight plan. Attention all aircraft information. Mike is now turned out in there 2998. So no change. Okay, let's check that flight plan. Two nine or nine or eight is what we have. We're gonna have to clear that discontinuity. Which isn't allowed. Yeah, actually there's just uh bumper. Is that what he said? Kept a bumper. Right, okay. So from the start, we go out. Canada 102 established 24 right. Canada 102 wins 220 at 14, gusting 20. Runway. Runway 24 right. Fill and 24 right, I can't answer 23. 
on heading 245. That's all we know. And then we go to Savar, Seket, Rivam, Kapta, Bumpa. Awesome. Toronto approach November 710. Mike Charlie is at flight level one. Oh, we got a duplicate and bumper there. Remember, 710 Mike Charlie arrivals, uh, squawk mode correction, squawk ident in sail for two. Okay, Roddy, Yoda, IGN, Lolly, Door, there's IGN. We're at Door, Landy. For 710 Mike Charlie. 71 LGA uh, manual. You are identified to run away 24 right altimeter 299 or 8. Information uh, Mike is on print, send 8000. For 22 right altimeter 299 or 8, and we'll get information right now. Two two left Kimball does not make sense, so. Let me get through that again. One zero, Mike Charlie. Would you rather uh, run with two three? Two two left. Say again for Mike Charlie. Zero, Mike Charlie. Would you rather run away two three? IGN. Uh, yes, sir. If that's able. Okay, Roger. I can expect it. Expect to run with two three for Mike Charlie. Air Canada seven eight forty five hundred. Mike at Sky Service, I have warranty. Have a good evening. Air Canada, 7045 departure. You're clear to the Tampa Airport. Got a beast 2 departure. Fox 2 transition. Flight Say no vias. Squawk 2216. Tampa now let's see. Foxy transition. Uh, so now we got up to also just say, runway two IGN. Air Canada, 7045. Air Canada 7045, read back correct, push and start is at your discretion. Door, Landy, LGA, manual. Ah, Kimball's still in there. Okay, so we've got a manual, we're going to be vectored anyway. Okay, initial climb out. Our departure. One zero, Mike Charlie, turn right heading three one zero. Right three one. One zero, Charlie, correction. Zero, Mike Charlie, correction. Right three five zero. Three five zero, Mike Charlie. Maintain five thousand. There we go. It's on the departure chart. So Mike Charlie, it looks like, uh, looks like you were going off course, are you uh, good there? Yes sir, I had to update the flight plan and uh, it gave me a discontinuity, but uh, it's all updated now. Thank you for Mike Charlie. So Mike Charlie, Roger. Okay, we've got everything on board, so let's disconnect the jetway. Direct to Bimpo and during the arrival for Mike Charlie. Okay, and our fuel I assume is... Oh jeez, I thought we were rolling back there, is it just a jetway? <laughs> okay, we got our fuel on board, perfect. And that's all I need you for, good night. Okay, and our fuel is correct, 5.9, perfect. 5.9 tons to get us to New York. Air Canada 102, welcome to Tron Pearson, right when able report for you. Right when able report for you, Air Canada 102. Okay, and our performance transition is 18,000 feet. And we have no flex temperature, and V1 is 135, rotate on 136, and V2140. Okay, I do believe that's everything. Just call a tug. Can I, uh, one, two, three, 
up to four right down the gate, one three three for us. Call when ready to taxi. Taxi via let's see. Okay, let's see, it's Delta, in the squawk. Alpha, Alpha Kilo to the apron cross. Two, two, one, one. Delta Alpha Alpha Kilo to apron and cross straight to your right, I can now answer two. Okay, switch on the rest of the lights here. Whoops. Reset the rudder to take off position. And the throttle at idle. Switch off the ground power. Fuel pumps on. Standby aiders to nav. Beacon. Seatbelts. Switching off. Oh no, let's keep the AP switch on. Sure, my Charlie, send 3000. Whoops. Down at 3000 for my Charlie. Okay, and we're gonna have the engine. Air Canada 102 looks like you made a right turn. Uh, correction, the, the, the wrong turn. You can make your next right on Victor. Okay, Alpha, Alpha Kilo cross 3 3 right. Yeah, order Victor and Alpha Kilo cross 3 3 right. I cannot answer to. Okay, we're gonna squawk active. Let's take off our parking brake. Let's look out for. Traffic, no traffic. Okay, we're gonna push out. Okay, looks like we're good to go. Uh, let's uh, let's pull out and start engine two. Charlie, turn left at any three three zero. Left for two three three zero for seven seven Charlie. Okay, let's set our parking brake. Start, let's start engine. Oh, sorry, engine two. Good start, let's start engine one. Let's hit our taxi lights. Mike Charlie, turn uh, left heading 270 and decide localizer, clear to Atlas 2 to approach. Left 270 and intercept localizer, clear. Okay, let's set flaps to take off position. Engine 1 good start, let's switch off the AP bleed and the APU. Normally I would do a flight control check, but I'm going to skip that. Okay, engine. 
engine to normal position. Okay, so hopefully we'll be taxiing Alpha or Bravo and then Hotel holding short 2 3. Departure American Airlines 13 Kilo ready for taxi. American 13 Kilo runway 23 altimeter 2998 taxi via Alpha Julia Alpha Hotel hold short of 23. Altimeter 2998 taxi uh, runway 23 via Alpha Juliet Alpha Hotel uh, and hold short 23. American Airlines 13 Kilo. Can I get a wind check for 7 7 Mike Charlie? Sir Mike Charlie, winds 220 at 14, that's in 20. Thank you, 7 7 Mike Charlie. Juliet. Alpha Hotel 23. Awesome. To Mike Charlie, clear land runway 23. Clear land runway 23 for 17, Mike Charlie. I think effects are pretty good.
interesting to see what happens when we get to New York now. Let me just have a quick peek and see how busy it is. That doesn't seem altogether too busy now, actually. Hold on a second. They've gone offline. Ah, what a pity. New York Center is online, but... Uh, looks like JFK went offline. We still have pretty good coverage on the way out. Uh, we switch over to Unicom for after departure. And then. Uh, welcome to Toronto Pearson, Red Bunny, Bull Taxi, via Juliet, Kilo to the evening. And right then, uh, and then Juliet, New York Center after a short while. likely will be cleared very soon now for departure so let's just advise the cabin ready clear for takeoff two three clear for takeoff two three American one three kilo okay so we'll roll straight out onto the runway let's hit our Take off lights. Canada 7045 midfield at Sky Service Taxi with Mike. Air Canada 7045 runway 23 altimeter 299 or 8 taxi via Echo Hotel across 15 left hold short 23. Runway 23 will hold short. Okay, let's just do a quick check on the config. Auto brake to max and quick config check. All green. And we're on the wheels. Just confirm we were cleared okay. across 15 right for 710 Mike Charlie. Okay, let's go. Thank you. Toga. And we'll keep heading to 4 or 5 on departure. Okay. Here we are. V1. Rotate. That's a positive rate. Gear up. Okay, a little too steep on the climb. Let's bring that speed up. There we go. Thrust back to climb. Flaps up. Autopilot one. Autopilot one. Oh, hold on. Heading mode. Heading mode. Two, four, five. Manage two, four, five.
climbing 5,000. Trust climb. Okay. Swing around to Saber. Making one for fuel this altitude passing. American one three kilo passing. Uh, oh, just at five thousand feet. American one three kilo. American one three kilo. Sorry, say again the altitude. Five thousand feet. American one three kilo. Making one three kilo identified turn left direct savior on course dying follow both two three here. Turning direct savior uh saver and climbing one three zero American one three kilo. Direct saver. And one three zero. The ice had to come on there. I forgot that. Okay, grind spurs off. And switch to keep an eye on our pressurization as we climb. Strobe light off. Oh, twenty. Twenty forty-five winds. Uh, two two zero fourteen. Twenty clip take off. Here for take off for me two three here. Got to go seventy forty-five. I wasn't able to see these. Turn the brightness up on these. That's better. Turn to approach. Good evening, Air Canada. One three five heavy with information mic. Good gate Delta two. Now we're talking. We've identified two one five Alpha. Ready for pushback. Okay, is our departure from Toronto? Air Canada one thirty five heavy. I'll be back as breakfast. Pushing stuff, my discretion will call for time to take hand over if I could. Okay, passing ten thousand. I'm going to switch off the landing lights. Switch out the wing lights since it's daylight. Uh, what is this? Map partially displayed. Okay. Why? Air Canada 7045 is 2,000. I can 7045. Sorry about that, American, correction, Air Canada, 7045, identify, climb 7000. 7000, Air Canada, 7045. Okay, so, uh, just a quick look at VATS by here. Um, there's American 13 Kilo leaving. 13 Kilo, uh, leaving right space to the east, around surface, terminated, clear my route. Copy air frequency change, America 13 Kilo, thank you very much. 122.8. Now we'll bring it up to our cruise of 370. 370. Three seven zero mother mother. There we go. Okay, anywho, we are on our departure. Let's 
is our departure. Bump of that transition. I'll be continuing on down south eastwards. Very for short flight actually out to New York. Less than an hour. And in New York, we have New York Center on 12532, which we can tune in, 12532. Let's just get that tuned on the standby. Yeah, so unfortunately, uh, just as we were taking off, JFK approach went offline. And, um, but I'm sure New York Center covers JFK. So let me make sure, yeah, KJFK. Okay, so we're still on. So we'll join their frequency soon. And, uh, That'll bring us all the way into New York with air traffic control. Awesome. Okay, gonna turn off the seatbelt signs and uh, well, we've still got a bit of cloud left, so we'll leave the anti-ice on for the moment. Uh, passing 18,000, we'll switch to standard Q and H and on our standby. They don't call it Q and H. I need to remember that actually. The altimeter. quiet. Some chatter on Unicom. Didn't quite hear what they were saying. Departing something has filed. No one has your flight plan though, you know. You can't see anyone else's flight plan in Unicom. Not that I know of actually. Okay, so we're on the IGN one arrival into New York. I hope my airplane knows what to do because I don't even know where IGN is. I assume it's a VOR or an NDV. It's got to be a VOR, right? Buffalo traffic, citation 64, Julia, Charlie taking off runway 23, heading southwest. There it is. Buffalo traffic, Delta 2739. Yes, it's a VOR DME. Okay, got you, IGN. 1176, Kingston. Have a look. We'll be coming down here. Kobe Arx Roddy, there's IGN. 
and then south. South, south, south to Dour. And then in via Lendi. And then I have this continuity. That's why I couldn't find the IGM one, because it's Kingston one. Kingston one arrival. Idiot. Okay. I feel comfortable having that now. Okay, let's get rid of those. Charts, we don't need them anymore. Okay, Kingston and Lottie down to Dour. Into LaGuardia, and then vectored from LaGuardia. last layer of cloud now and then I will switch off the anti-ice okay we're well outside the departure for Toronto now and we'll be coming up on New York Center soon so I'm gonna tune in New York Center now and they are on 2532 No ASIS for New York Center, but I'm going to assume we can still expect the same runway for the moment. Hopefully, they don't change it. Depart suite heading 080. American 2989, depart suite heading 080. Depart suite on 080. American 2989. Altair 1555, New York Center, hello. Uh, Crunch on the crest, uh, two seconds here. FedEx 4121, descend and maintain 5000. 5000, FedEx 4121. Okay, Altair let's have a look at our approach and available. Advise, the first altitude restriction is at Lolly 200. Clear to Echo Delta Delta Bravo, Kennedy 5 departure, radar vectors Betty, and it's 5, meaning to 5,000. They expect level 390, 1 zero minutes after departure. Departure frequency is with me, it's 471 There's a lot of instructions. So 5055, read back is correct, push and starts at your discretion, call ready for taxi. Okay, then we'll be at... Oops, uh, that's annoying. Um, what was our altitude going to be? Our cruise is 370. 370, coming down to 200. Air Canada 24 across Copes at a main... It's 17,000 feet. So we'll need about 63 nautical miles. 
Air Canada 24 across the Copes at a main team, level 220. 220 Copes uh, at an rate of 824. <laughs> Skip that there, 63 nautical miles. The hotel, we leave Alpha, remain uh, uh, below the Bravo now. Please clear the Bravo. Clear the Bravo, leave Alpha. Yeah, 1997, descend and maintain 4000. Yeah, I'm a 4000, yeah, 1997. Okay, plenty of time. American 2989, descend and maintain 6000, maintain 6000, please. Descend and maintain 6000, American 29. Okay, we can switch out that anti-ice now. Uh, let's put that off. Engine one, engine two, engine one, wing, and we'll switch this back to normal. Senator, do you have the uh, uh, landing runway at New York? American 29, and I apologize if I didn't get it to Isla's approach from a 22 left. I nice. Yeah. Awesome. That's what we have. Thank you. Delta forty one sixteen, descend and maintain six thousand. Descend and maintain six thousand. American 2989, reduce speed to 210. Uh, 210, speed, American 2989. November 301 Alpha Zulu, New York Center, say route to leaving. Uh, 3000. Thank you, number 301 Alpha Zulu, radar contact. Turn right, heading uh, 360, climb and maintain, flight level 370. I turn 360, 370. Play off 0365 midfield runway 4 for Voco. Play off 0365 runway 4, we have the option on the uh, go, make left traffic, port midfield. Left traffic, port midfield, uh, runway 4, play off 0365. Okay, we're being asked to contact him. Boston 134 700. Okay, didn't expect that. 134. 700. Jet Blue 111, near center. Hello. Radar contact uh, 15 miles to the southwest. Boston Center, hello. American Airlines 13 Kilo is at flight level 346 for 370. American 13 Kilo, Boston Center, hello. Squawk 4754. Squawk 4754, four, American 13 Kilo. American 13 Kilo Radar contact 200 miles northwest of X Stall, climb and maintain about 370. Uh, climb and maintain 370, American 13 Kilo, and please repeat the previous instruction. I'm sorry, second. I didn't copy the first part of your transmission. I copied uh, climb and maintain 370, American 13 Kilo. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, radar contact 200 miles northwest of X Stall. Copy, thank you, American 13 Kilo.
I find uh, some of these American guys actually talk way, way faster than the European guys. And uh, I reckon that's probably because the mix of languages in Europe, that they speak generally slower to compensate for the differences in languages. contact New York Center, 125.32, have a nice day. But they're all English speaking yeah. here, so I think they just do things a lot faster. our altitude and we're just about Mach decimal 783 and we're still uh, 140 nautical miles out from the lobby which is our first restriction on altitude Descend 63, 64 nautical miles before lolly, depending on wind conditions. At the moment, we have a tailwind, quite okay, a strong tailwind. 17 contact Boston approach 133.0. Have a nice day. I'm sure going to be switched back over yeah. to New York Center. New York Center was. It's funny, I don't see Boston Center online. <laughs> ah, there they are. Okay, so he's going to hand us over to New York Center. Okay, gotcha. 2532. Okay, we've that on standby. Yeah, fair enough. I thought we were going to go straight into New York. 2689 with you passing 8000 to uh, fellow with one in. But uh, 2689 Boston Center. Hello. There we are. We cross crossed into Boston Center just about, and then we'll go south down into New York. And there's JFK just here. In terms of our arrival, um, still a bit to go before we need to descend, as we saw. This is our arrival here, the Kingston, or uh, as I found out, it was also known as the India Gulf November 1 arrival, which I wasn't looking for. I wasn't looking for Kingston. So we come in north over New York. Looks like New York City is just at this peninsula here, so we'll come over north over the city. And we'll still be pretty high, I'd say we'll have cloud cover, so we're not going to have visual on the ground at that point. So we won't see New York City, I don't think. Unfortunately, not today. What's the current time in New York, anyway? I think I said good evening to somebody. Ah, oh, okay, it's 5 p.m. That's fine. expect this will get busier now. If it's only 5 p.m. East Coast time, then uh, it'll definitely get busier as people finish their work day.
get air 788 Bravo two, flight level 26.2 two for 290 direct Burlington. Boston 788 Bravo, Boston, hello, squawk 4732. 4732, Alaska 788 Bravo. Boston, there's a negative 2 Delta Bravo, I'm going to go Delta Bravo, Boston Center, hello, fly, I'm going to maintain, pedal 282. I'm going to say file 280 to Delbravo. Some of these guys sound so young. <laughs> future pilots. I have no future as a pilot. But these guys do. Might. That's cool. Cruise altitude. Let's set our performance for arrival. We know what runway we're coming in on. Uh, we do not know the altimeter. Although I could be cheeky and just check the meter. Okay, Google. According to Google, the altimeter is. Alaska 788, Bravo, radar contact over Burlington. Maintain puddle 290. 290, Alaska 788, Bravo. Alaska, I'm sorry, American 13 kilo, cross Lolly, at and maintain flight level 200. Crossing Lolly at flight level 200 and maintain 200, American 13 kilo. Delta 006, it appears New York is closing. Radar service terminated. Frequency change of food. Have a nice day. Sorry, that one must have been for me. Delta 006, New York is closing. Unicom, have a ah, nice day. It wasn't me. What's your Unicom, Delta 006? Well, uh, he's going to tell me the same as well, anyway. New York is closing. Balls. Okay, anyway. Let's proceed. Wind 100 zero at 1-1. One one. Temperature. Check the QNH again. Or sorry, the altimeter again as we get closer. Just need to keep an eye on the progress. We need to descend. In the next few miles, we need to begin our descent down to two zero zero. American 2689, climb and maintain, flight level 360. Absolute flight level 360, American 2689. Okay, we don't want to be too high before we get there. Um, so let's start descent. We do have a tailwind as well, so, okay. 200. Our 
the scent rate be? Boston Center, Jet 3166. You mentioned the uh, New York Channel's closed? Yeah, they're closing soon. How did that say? Jet Blue 111 with you over Kennedy at flight level 270. Jet Blue 111 Boston, good. And Boston Center, Jeff Blue 3722, you need to step away for five minutes. Approved. American 2689, leaving my airspace. New York is closing. Radar service terminated. Frequency change approved. Take care. Take care, we're on our way to the Good evening, Boston Center, number 301. Okay, looks like we're going to be arriving at Unicorn. Number 301 Alpha Zulu, Boston Center, hello. I was hoping for an ATC arrival. Well, the, the arrival is pretty straightforward anyway. Uh, we just get the vectors for 2 2 left, and it's an ILS approach, fairly standard. The, uh, the good thing about it was the departure. Um, it could be really complicated when they get the couple of frequencies. They only had the one Toronto frequency, um, so. And the departure was pretty simple as well. But um, finally, the US departures can be much more complicated than a European style. We are calling one to flight level 1000, direct to air. Air Canada 613 Boston Center, hello, climb and maintain, follow 340. Climb and maintain, uh, flight level 340, Air Canada 613. So as soon as we get to Kingston, we'll be taking a right turn. That will be us, I think. We'll be on to you, Carl. JetBlue 111, clear direct to Roebuck. This set of maintain, but I will 230. So there's New York there, way down there. Number five, that's what's going for clearance to Charlie Yankee Django Zulu. Descent rate is really fast. We don't need that fast descent rate. We can take it easy. American 2320 Boston Center, hello, squawk 4731. Okay, descending, that means pressurization. Explain flight level 2603. Um, okay, so 49 like a Mazda, got a pretty sharp turn at Kingston. So we got about, well, 10 minutes or so. Let's get everyone in their seats. American 2320, radar contact 120 miles west of Ponset. Maintain pedal with 330. Oh, they just made it a correction in the flight plan. But we have to overfly Kingston? Is that practically rival? American 13 Kilo will be leaving my airspace shortly. New York is now closed. Radar service terminated. Frequency change approved. Take care. Frequency change approved. Copy uh, American 13 Kilo. Thanks very much. Metro 40 leaving my airspace. Moncton's closed. Radar service terminated. Frequency change approved. Take care. Oh no. Look at this stupid ATIS now. How do I switch that off? Oh, it's gonna keep playing. Are you kidding me? I don't want it to pause. If I go into one of these menus, is it gonna pause?
So anybody on Unicom in this area gets that. I'll mug stop right in there anyway. Okay, you can see New York has just gone offline now. We'll be taking a right turn at Kingston and then towards JFK, so we'll be offline. Oh well. Changed again. Twenty. Okay, gotta keep an eye on this traffic now. So. See traffic in the area. That uh, looks like a V4 traffic or traffic on the ground. Traffic on the ground. Above. Okay. Okay for the moment. Okay, so as far as our vectors go now, we're not going to have ATC for our vectors. So we're supposed to get vectors from LaGuardia. For 2-2 left, um, so we leave LaGuardia. And I'm guessing... We have a look at LaGuardia. Gonna have to head north, actually. Okay, is that one nine or zero? Let 
Kimball. Kimball descending to 140, we'll go Kimball. Kimball doesn't make sense, LaGuardia is out there. Makes better sense to go hair. that roof around and 2-2. Two two. So once we get past LGA we'll go to Hare, cross JFK and descending to 10,000. Okay, that's uh, flight level 200 by Lolly. See, the RJFK should be at about our 10 o'clock now. here it's not too bad here so New York is down this way somewhere City, we could go from Lendy direct Kimball. That might make more sense. Yeah, we'll go Lendy direct Kimball. Descend one four zero then. Okay, descending one four zero. One four zero will bring us to our, our altimeter, uh, which was 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 was, was three zero. Three one. Three zero three one. Three zero. Three zero two eight. He says. Well, I don't think I'll go on my own there. Thanks. One zero two six. One zero two six on standby. All right. Okay, so we're in the Lendy.
So as we approach, the city should be just in front of us now. see any detail from here. Head direct Kimball. That should tidy up our arrival a bit. Yes. Awesome. New York JFK traffic, American Airlines 13 Kilo is on the approach for 22 left, inbound Kimball, uh, flight level 140. New York traffic. now to the city it'll be just in front of us we're a bit high to see anything City down there, but uh, we're too high to see any detail. Okay, we're coming into some clouds here. Let's see what temperature we had. Uh, temperature had is one. So I am going to turn on some anti-ice. Now we're going to start descending to 10,000 now. We'll be flying over JFK soon. Take a quick look at our traffic situation. American 13 Kilo. And that's around. Before departing to landing. Ok, 
Okay, let's descend down 10,000 now. I wish that ADA service would shut up. Five five three eight traffic uh, below at two thousand. He's departing. Okay, no factor. Okay, let's continue descent to whoops. Rock. Continue descent to eight thousand. Getting these figures from the arrival chart here. 10,000, 8,000, descending to 6,000, 4,000. Um, we'll need to be at Rosley by 3. Rosley. Okay, we're passing 10,000. Let's switch on our landing lights. Just a little bit of cloud around, so I'm going to leave the anti ice on. Ice not detected. No, ice is detected. We'll keep on switching, I'd say. Okay, so the speed changed, the restriction changed to 250 knots, so that's why we're not descending as fast. So I'm going to continue my descent now down, right down to 3,000. So I make my way around. Slow right down as well. So let's say 220 knots. JFK behind us. Let's see it yet. Cloud cover. Good one, your traffic United 151. Taxi 21V21. LaGuardia, okay. Take delay vectors here if I can't get down in time. Let's have an open descent. Whoops, open descent. Ah, oh, Jesus. First stage flaps.
LaGuardia traffic, you want to take 151 taking off from runway 21 LaGuardia. get another stage of flaps help us descend a little bit faster Get down to 3000 by Rosley. Okay, we're in the soup. Okay, let's have a slight delay vector. For Rosley. So we need to be 3000. John F. Kennedy traffic, uh, American Airlines 13 Kilo is inbound Rossley for 22 left approach. Uh, John F. Kennedy traffic. Okay, clearing a little as we pass 4000. Okay, it looks like we're good to go direct Rossley. Let's proceed. Um, the LS frequency for our approach is 110.9. Let's see what we got. 110.9. Okay, let's put on our landing systems. That's 3000. Our next drop is Zalpo, 1800. Overspeed, 1800. 1,800. Sending in 1,000. Oops. 1,800. Open descent. Okay, runway in sight, 2-2 two, two left. 2500. Okay, we're going to get our cabin ready for our landing. Please prepare for lose the anti-ice now. And our air brakes aren't needed anymore. Uh, let's see if we go flaps three. That's iron ground spurs. visual on the runway so let's put our gear down at this stage bring our speed back okay let's arm approach mode John F. Kennedy traffic, American 13 Kilo is on an 8 mile final for 2 2 left. John F. Kennedy traffic. Okay, final stage of flaps.
Schneidermacher. Missed approach. Time to find the feet and then the three thousands. Missed approach altitude set. Glide slope. Final approach speed. Seem to have lost final approach speed for some reason. I'm not sure why. John and F. Kennedy traffic, American Airlines, 13 kilos on 5 mile final for 2 2 left. John and Kennedy traffic. Okay, traffic below. Let's switch off autopilot 2 for submarine. That's on. My controls. Let's keep auto trust there. And let's switch our auto brake to low. Taxi lights. Okay, falling a little bit low and left. Five hundred. Glad we have that aid is all the way. Nice, comforting voice. Reverse. Airport chart. Okay, uh, can we make this exit? Ooh, no. Okay, no worries. Let's keep going until the next one. Should we Juliet? Okay, we see Juliet. idle. John F. Kennedy traffic American 13 Kilo is vacated at Juliet from 22 left. John F. Kennedy traffic. So we won't go the international terminal. Head down uh, towards Terminal 2. And we'll be using taxiway Juliet. Okay, trust idle. Let's get those landing lights off. John F. Kennedy traffic, American 13 Kilo is passing 4 left, 2 2 right via Juliet. John F. Kennedy traffic. Oh, we should really have a 
strobe. by New York Center now. I would have enjoyed some air traffic control coming in. Next time. Okay, coming up on Terminal 2. Let's take this exit here, Lima Alpha. crate in our way. Okay. signs off. We can connect our jetway to let people off the plane. I get the luggage off. available so maybe we don't need the APU but we'll shut down our engines I think in reality it would have been done quite differently anyway here we are in JFK